Hello and welcome to BB's Backlog Challenge. This time we're playing Cube or Cube or Cube. I don't know. Cube. We'll go with Cube. I know it's going to take exactly one hour because I've got some potatoes cooking and they take one hour exactly. That's exciting. Hopefully this game's a bit more exciting than that. So probably the first thing anyone thinks of when they see this game is Portal. And I think that's fair enough because it's very Portal reminiscent. Seems like a much darker take on Portal, if you like. So let's jump straight in. And what if it didn't kill him? With all due respect, your best guess is still just a guess. You need to have faith in the possibility of good. Wait. Hold on. His oxygen consumption's going up. I think he's alive. He's conscious. Hey, go steady down there. He's been out for a couple weeks. Fifteen days, in fact. They thought you were dead. If it wasn't for your life suit, you probably would be. <laughs> Listen, there's been a complication. We can't link it to your POV camera, and it looks like communication are only working one way. You can hear me, I hope, but I can't hear you. That means we don't know how badly you were affected by the transportation. If you're feeling confused or disoriented, you should know that deep space travel can do you pretty serious psychological damage, especially to your memory. Even a few hours out there in the dark can cause permanent problems. I'm gonna be honest with you. Mission control are concerned you might have no idea who you're in there. If that's true, I have some difficult facts for you. You're a long way from Earth. A very long way. But every single person on the planet is depending on you. That thing you're inside right now, whatever it is, is gonna hit Earth in the next few hours. And if it does, that's the end of everything. You need to decipher and dismantle it from the inside before that happens. I just hope you haven't forgotten how. We all do. Now listen carefully. This is important. The reason why it's me talking to you and not mission control is because you're too far out into deep space. Their signal can't reach you out there, but mine can. I'm Commander Novak. I'm an astronaut on board the International Space Station. I'm going to relay everything they tell me, but the bad news is, every time I orbit around the far side of the Earth, I'll move out of radio range. Oh. When that happens, Oops. you're going to be on your own for a while. Just stay calm and keep your head straight until I get back into range. Okay, this is it. I'm orbiting out of range now. I'll be back soon. Just remember what I've told you. And believe it. Yeah, sure, okay. Stark white walls weird scientific kind of setting and a disembodied female voice telling me what to do i have been trained not to listen to you i'm afraid all right let's go through this weird corridor so we're definitely going to do what she tells us to right i can jump and i can make things glow come on let me in let me in let me in this is exciting isn't it no oh, behind me isn't that always the way? Okay. Oh. They go different colours. Interesting. Not even slightly. Okay. My hands. Whoa. Whoa. What does red do? Red does boxes. Ooh. Okay. So left goes up, right goes down. Easy enough. Easy. Aha. We got this. 
Ah, well, I'm not sure about. I can handle blue. That's gonna bounce me, right? Yay! Hee <laughs> hee. That's fun. Okay. Ha! Yeah. Boing! Wee! <laughs> Okay, my favourite one is the blue one. No, nope, not yet. Pull it out further. And then... Boing! I promise I won't say boing every time I click on one of those, just every other time. Okay, yellow. Don't like yellow. Oh no, don't like yellow at all. Can I make that? No. Ah, I see. So the one I click on is the one that goes up. Yeah. Cool. Nice. I missed the blue ones. Hmm. What do I want? Middle? Nope, I think that's right. Yeah. Yay, blue's back. Excellent. Okay, let's get the top one out first. Yeah, like that. Boing! See, every other time. I'm a bunny. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Oh, we don't like that. Okay, they're not crushing me. That's fine. Okay. I see. Not too bad so far. I'm sure it's going to break my brain later on. And that's sector one. Pretty simple. Green. I didn't agree to green. Alright, what does green do? I can't click it at all. Uh huh. All right. I don't understand. I see. Do I want that there? I guess so. Yes. And then that just puts it back. Fair enough. The bouncy one. So I assume we can bounce the green thing. Then we've got to catch it. Yeah. That's fun. One there. Get up here. Get up here. And we're safe. I think I got this one. Yep. <laughs> hmm. Not quite. There we go. 
it's a very similar aesthetic to Portal, but a very different atmosphere. Definitely a lot uh, creepier. Not to say Portal wasn't creepy. Beg your pardon, sir. 919. I will definitely not remember that. Balls! That's not a cube. What madness is this? <laughs> Alright. Oh, I crushed my ball. Not something anyone wants to hear. Hmm. Madness is this. Is that gonna do it? Hmm. All right. Let's try that again then. Try to push it along a bit. Then we can do one of them. There we go. Awesome. Ah, oh, I can't go down there. Balls only. Ah, oh, really? That was quick. Alright. Let's get to it. Sector 3. Purple. Whoa. <laughs> cool. Alright. We... I feel like I want to land on that. If I can, somehow. Yeah, like this. That's starting to get trippy now. Please, thank you. Go up there, and then we turn it round. That's kind of dizzy. Ugh. Okay, what do we got? Is that going to move my blue? Yes it is. Okay. So we want to get that on that wall for sure. It bounces over. Maybe not. No. Definitely not. Okay. So we get that there and then we move the red one over to this wall. Your cube ain't so tough. No. Oh. Spoke too soon, huh? Oops. What am I doing? Okay. Now I want to drop onto the blue and bounce myself up. Hopefully. Yep. Easy. Put a bit of swagger in it. Hello. Oh. Can you hear me? Nope. No. Because your radio's out, we don't know if you've lost your memory or not. If you have, it could it could be bad for the mission. <laughs> One of the methods they use to bring back memories of amnesiac patients is to talk to them about important events in their lives. So, before you left, we wrote you up some letters that you used to communicate with them. It's a letter to you about you. Hmm. Yeah. 
Yeah. Oh, I don't like that. Who is the creepy man coming back? Creepy man? Creepy man? Uh. All right. What do we do here? Oh, my taters are ready. Be happy. Baby is an egg. I don't know why that woman can't let me turn my taters in peace. Let's solve this stupid puzzle. No, that's not fair. I don't know that it's a stupid puzzle yet. Do I want that to happen? Let's find out. No. No, I don't. Hmm. It's a bit rude. Oh, really? It resets the whole thing? Can I get up there? Can I get up there? Do I want to get up there? Oof. Huh. That doesn't get... Oh, it did that time. Okay. Why well, didn't that work the first time? No up. Now we move that one round. And... Trust in the power of science. Science has failed me. If I reset everything... That doesn't help me at all. Oh, I know, I know. Overthinking it. Way overthinking it. There we go. Yeah. It's all on the wonk. Alright. Hit play and then shove my balls. Okay. Not too difficult so far. I have a feeling this is training me for something that's going to be a lot tougher. Three up. Okay. There we go. Yeah, here we go. Nope. I accidentally had it and then I messed it up. Put that back over there. Close that one again. There we go. Use this one to push it into position and then raise that and just let it do its thing. I don't think that was how I was supposed to do it, but it worked. Hooray! The power of science, ladies and gentlemen, and non binary friends, of course. Can you hear me? Yeah. Say again? He's not going to say it again. Hmm. Ghost blocks. Right, let's see what just happens if I just run it, I guess. Oh. Oh. That's pretty cool. See. Ha. That's really cool. 
Okay. Okay. <laughs> I love it. I'm sure I'll stop loving it when it gets tough. But for now, I love it. Boing! I still have to say boing sometimes. Ooh. Creepy. I don't know what I'm doing. I feel like I've gone the wrong way. Can I go back? I can. It's like a... Like a secret area or something. Alright, let's see what this is all about. Hmm. Ooh. They're all weird colours. I don't like this. I don't like it. Make it stop. What am I doing here? Just extend everything, I guess. This pattern must mean something, surely. Oh, I think I understand. Ooh, that's trippy. Alright. So I want to get the colors lined up. Like if I stand exactly there, it lines up. Oh, that's cool. So, okay, okay, okay. Let's think about this logically. Let's do it sensibly. As much as I can. I guess if I'm standing here, yeah. So there's red, yellow, blue. I gotta say, that's really cool. Extend that one all the way out. Perfect. Okay. So, oh, not that one. Need to make sure these colors line up too. So that one does. Okay. Magic, magic. Right, what color do we want this one to be? I think I want that one on the other side then. Or maybe. Maybe I want it vertically. Yep, looks like vertical is the way to go. Very nice. But how do we get these ones in the middle? Is that right? Oh, that's not right at all. I enjoyed the fact that there's. Apparently some very important things going on outside of this cube thing, and I'm just sitting here playing with colours. I feel like I'm missing something. Must be the back one then. If that doesn't work either, then the colours just don't line up at all. I seem to be missing something. That's almost right. Unless I want to be doing it that way instead. Yeah. That seems kind of obvious. How embarrassing. Sure I'm glad I didn't stream that to the internet. There we are. What did that do? Got an achievement. Alright, I got an achievement, and that's all. Guess let's carry on then. Okay, time to play with my balls. Oh, just let it do its thing. It'll get there. Just about. Ah, uh, I was like one pixel off. How annoying. Oops. No, don't want a green ball. Give it a shove. There we go. Perfect.
no, that's just gonna make it blue again. What am I, what am I thinking? Okay. That's how you make it yellow, but... Hmm. As is the nature of these kind of games, when you're watching someone else play a, a puzzle that you've, you've figured out, it annoys the life out of you. So I apologize. I just completely blank. Okay. So we pull that one up. Get it in yellow, then we roll it. Hopefully far enough. No. Not anywhere near. It's a dilly of a pickle, isn't it? That didn't help at all. Nope. <laughs> Too quick on the draw. No, that's just not far enough. Can I push it? Imagine if I can push this and I've been trying to roll it the whole time. No, didn't think so. Alright, well let's work on the red one first. Let's work on the red one first. Okay, there we go. Then we can do that. Okay, that's easy. Oh, then... I should be able to just take it over, right? Let's try it. If I didn't miss it. There we go. in the hole and let's continue who's this I'm back in range. hello Fingers crossed. how you doing here we go uh oh she found my live journal. I'm only reading this because you wrote it to yourself. Oh no. It was 3 p.m. on a Sunday. You were upstairs at home. A teenage boy broke into your house. What? He thought you were away on vacation. He went downstairs with your gun. You shot him in the living room. Only he wasn't trying to rob you. He was passing by and saw fire in the kitchen. Broke in to try and put it out. He was young and stupid and probably should have thought of a better solution. But you assumed the worst. You assumed the very worst and you shot him. He was paralyzed from the neck down. He died seven years later. Well, at night, in Penrose St. Francis Hospital. I'm orbiting out. Fingers crossed. I, I just kind of just want to go home now, actually. All of this cute business just seems futile after that. Oh well, let's go. Solve some puzzles. Play with colours. Bounce balls. Hooray! Happy fun. Joy times. Now, more of this nonsense. Okay. I want to mix colours this time. Well, I don't want to. I have to mix colours this time. Please? Please? Gonna, gonna keep going. Ball. Ball. Thank you. Ah, it's gonna very slowly go where I wanted to go. Fantastic. 
Let's all watch. Yay! All right, that's one. Uh, green. Next green is yellow and blue. Then ah, I missed. Not entirely digging the controls. I mean, I understand. There's not really a better way to do it, probably, but it can be pretty finicky to click the right part. Hooray! Orange. Orange is yellow and red. We're learning colours today, guys. Now, hopefully, this one's going to be like... Ah, oh, there we go. That works even better. Except, how do I get it in there once it's... Hmm. I don't know how well this will work. Punt! Yay! Easy. Sector 5. Here we go. Hey. Ah. Hey. Ah. Keep it going. What? They didn't tell me where I am. Hmm. All right. But I also know not to listen to disembodied male voices. So, ooh, oh, I don't like that. Oh no, 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 no. Don't want it. Thank you. Because I have no choice. Well, it's very atmospheric. Yeah. Man, I hate dark puzzles. Ooh. Cool. Boing! <laughs> Don't fully understand what I'm doing. Is that still active? It is. Okay. So I can extend the red one out until it's reaching where the yellow one is or near enough. Pull the blue one out. Bounce onto where I think the red one is. Yeah, there it is. And then up the yellow one. Peepy guy? I hope you can hear oh. me. The light's on the outside of the cube have gone dark. Is your control thing that's good? It's not. You must have hit it somewhere that hurt. I'm done anything. I'm just solving puzzles. Too true. I'm orbiting out of range. Bye. Keep going. Love you. Hmm. Is that where the yellow one is? Yes. Is that what I wanted to do? I feel like no. Alright. Ah. Get on the green. 
and then push the yellow up like that. Haha. Up yours, cube. Okay. Oh no, you've got to be kidding me. In the dark. I want to test what that's moving. It's not moving the green one. It is moving the red one. Did I say green? I meant blue. So there's the red, there's the yellow. Okay, I think I get it. Stand on with red, activate the blue one, but make sure the yellow one is out. Let's try it. Hey. Meiji's watching this and thinking, where was all this logical thinking when we were playing Portal 2 co-op? And she'd be right. Okay. So now we've got to play with our balls in the dark. Okay. Not too tough. I don't know how well this darkness is transferring on the stream. that out. Okay. Not too travel. Oh, okay. So now we've got the purple ones to contend with again. Hmm. I think I know what I need to do here. That looks about right. Yeah. There's light! Light at the end of the tunnel! Run towards the light, cube! Cube man! Oh! Dude, this guy's hardcore. It's like the anti Wheatley. Now, how in the heck did someone build all of this stuff underground? That looks fun. Okay. Magnets. Oh, oh boy. Okay. Now we're doing it. Can I walk through this or is it going to kill me? Ah, okay, it's fine. We're playing with cubes. Hmm. Ah, 
that's kind of annoying because you can't see where the box is. I was wondering if it would just kind of float through the air or not. Bit closer. There we are. Oh no, not close enough. Ah, I see. That's cool. I know what to do. Let's see if we can get the red one, just the edge of it. There we go. Ha! <laughs> Love it. box and one more what did that do for me I see okay very cool that opens that for me To move it back. And then get on it. Normally by this point in this kind of game I'm really struggling, but I'm doing alright. And the hour's nearly up, so I can pretend like I always do this well. Yep. I have good news. Actually, two pieces of good news. Ooh. Ooh. So we're going to organize a wake up tier one. My wife. She's dying to talk to you. <laughs> She's dying to talk to you. I'm orbiting out of range again, so good luck. And be careful. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Alright. How do we handle this mess? Stop. Jeez. Okay, I think I get it. Up, oh, please, thank you. Alright, if we get them the same distance apart, turn that off. And turn it quickly on and off again. I think this should do it. Good enough. Okay. I'm some kind of brain genius. Whoops. <laughs> okay. So get that over there. Turn it off. Call it back a little bit more. Yep. And then what do I do next? What am I doing? Is this right? No. Maybe. No. Almost. Almost right. <laughs> I had almost the right idea. Okay, let's see if we can catch it. Not quite. Is this good enough? One more, there we go. That'll do it. I'm a brain genius. I got the attractive achievement, that's nice. Oh, I remember this one. Midgey was having a lot of trouble on this one. Let's see. Okay. Uh, 
and it's about the hour, so let's give it a couple of tries and see if we can figure it out. Oh, I can move the magnet. Hmm. Do I want to move the magnet? Got one of them. I think. All right, so that's how I stop this one. And then, okay, I think I get it. Maybe this wasn't the one she was having a lot of trouble with. But as soon as I push that, it's not going to stay there, is it? Well, we can but try. Is that long enough to count? is not. I think I might be overthinking this one again. Hmm. <laughs> I think I know what I'm trying to do. It's not that. Ah, I can drag them with the magnet. I see. That's good to know. But that's going to move that one. How annoying. Hmm. I need to stop it on top of this block. Like that. Almost. Okay, I think we get it. What am I doing? <laughs> probably an easy way of doing this, but if there is, I haven't thought of it. Hmm. I seem to be able to just almost catch it. I know, you're all screaming at me, you've all figured it out, you're thinking BB's a loser. Ah, I missed. Too easy to miss. I've got to figure this out soon, my potatoes are burning. No, I can't do that quick enough, so that's not right. Normally by this point in this kind of game, I'm really struggling, but I'm doing alright. If I give it one of them, that's not going to work either. Can I try and do this? Whatever this is. Try and drop it on there. No. Okay, I think that will work. I don't think it's the way I'm supposed to do it, but I think it'll work. Alright, a little bit further. A little bit further. Again, I apologise. Ah, too far this time. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we get it on the left wall. We turn it on, minimize that, and then push it out, and that doesn't help us at all. What? Well, that about wraps up my hour. <laughs> Seems like a good place to stop. So, fin or bin? Well, I've been having fun up until this point. <laughs> But I think I'm done with it, so I'm going to put it in the bin. No, I'm kidding. It's pretty cool. It's like Dark Portal. Like, edgy portal. I'm into it. I'm down for it. I'm down to see where the story goes, where the puzzles go. Yep, it's going to go in the fin pile. And I'm going to... For the sake of the video, I'm going to record my solving of this puzzle and stitch it in at the end here. Just, you know. I can't end it on this, though. Okay. So, I have failed to start recording. <laughs> three times. Three times. <laughs> and then I have failed to start the audio. Well, failed to start recording two times. I was counting that as okay. the third time. Well, there have been three failures. <laughs> not including my failure to solve this puzzle. Hi, I'm Midgey. This is Midgey. She's here to judge me. Yes. <laughs> and possibly help me solve I'm the puzzle. I'm doing very good at judging. 
judging me wrong. She is judging me harshly, as well I deserve. So we've been over the puzzle logically. Okay, we've gotten so far as that cube is for that this square. This cube is for this. And this cube is for that square. That one. can't do anything else. This one. And that one can't, can't interact with the red thing. This one can't touch this. Yes. And that's as far as I've got. So you just established with your little demonstration there that the cube on the right. This one? No. <clears throat> can stay in place in two different positions of the magnet. Right. How many positions of the magnet can the other cube stay in the correct place with? Really just the one yes. when it's on the end of this. Right. Right. That's my question. <laughs> I can I can ask more if you want, but I mean I think that should <laughs> put you on a track maybe? Let's hope. What are you doing? I don't have any feet. <laughs> <laughs> you are so good at this. <laughs> oh. oh, it got stuck again. That would work. Weird. <laughs> no. If I remember to turn the magnet on, that would have worked. But as it stands. <laughs> <laughs> no, it wouldn't have because the other one would have been at the bottom and you'd have to get it up and then it would be. <laughs> yeah. So that wouldn't have worked at all. Nope. Shut up. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> now this is all wrong. <laughs> <laughs> now none of the cubes are in the right place. <laughs> That's right. Hooray. <laughs> But if I do that, then it goes. It doesn't. You can't. You can't get. It. All right, calm down, sir. <laughs> Everything's terrible forever. Okay. Put the cubes back down on the floor. Okay. How do you get the right cube to the right spot? You, the right one being this one, and the right spot being the correct spot. Yes. Okay. How do you do that? Do that. And then put the magnet on top, and then magnet it, and then it stays. Right. Right. If you do that, it's going to happen to the other one. Going to go up there and then stick to the wall. Right. <laughs> Basically. Uh-huh. Uh, what if... Okay. I don't want to tell you how to do it. I'm just trying to... Sure. Gently. Sure. Like a scared horse. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> How long does it take for the cubes to get to the ceiling? One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. About four seconds. Hmm. Is that enough time to do something? Probably enough time to solve the puzzle. <laughs> Ooh. Whoa, that's <laughs> weird. What, you're, what, what you've done right now, oh, put it back. <laughs> that. Yeah? What if you did it sooner? What if I... What? <laughs> <laughs> we were talking about how the cubes take three Mississippi to get up there. Yeah? Okay, look at where the cubes are up there during three Mississippi. Uh-huh. And where your magnet is now. Uh -huh. What if you put it there sooner? <laughs> like that. Uh huh. I was doing that and it wasn't working. What do you mean it wasn't working? I kept doing this. Every time I tried it, it did this. You just miss it by like a hair. Well, do it better then. <laughs> <laughs> you mean I've been doing it right the whole time? <laughs> I was doing it right and it wasn't working, so I tried other things and now it's. <laughs> so this is going in the bin pile. What? <laughs> we haven't even got to the terrible one yet. There, see? Perfect. 
Hallelujah. We solved the puzzle. <laughs> and I'm going to cut to exactly that part. <laughs> hey, I help. What? But as soon as she sees it poking out of the dirt, she pours on more soot and burns to kill it. Okay. You're making a cube for a part. You're going to get to talk to your wife. You're going to get out. You're going to go home. You're going to save the whole earth. That's a poison. And you're drinking it. If you want it to stop, you have to stop it. Stop it? Apparently I'm drinking the Haterade. Who's saying that? The creepy man. Uh Uh-huh. Who does not sound trustworthy. He sounds kind of off his rocker, to be honest. Maybe a little bit like Ratman. A little bit like Ratman, yes. (laughs) Who was also wrong. Hmm. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Mm-hmm. Well, anyway, I said I'd cut after I'd solved the puzzle, and I have now solved the puzzle, which apparently I had already done. Just, I hadn't executed it correctly. So... Yay me, and also boo me. It's a fin. See you next time.